What's going on, guys? Ghost here to talk about the UCLA games. Uh, Washington was pretty disgusting, first of all. They blew a fat lead. Not a fat lead, but a double-digit lead with seven minutes to go, and they were very unclutch. I didn't see it from beginning to end, but saw that second half. Uh, I, I did watch a replay of the second half, and I was disgusted. This whole team found ways to just collapse. Not being clutch when they needed to. You know, the Stanford game... And the UW game, they both found ways to lose. Uh, they both found ways to lose, just in the final minutes. It's it's painful. They can't take a good shot. They can't be clutch. Uh, Tyler Lamb, it's horrible. I don't know why Norman Powell was shooting that one near the end. They they've had that inability to be clutch uh, for quite some time. Uh, this ever since Darren Collison has left, it's, they haven't had that clutch ability. This group of players. Um, so many disappointments recruiting-wise, so many disappointments left and right. It's it's not even funny. Very fan. Sad, sad, sad. Uh, you know, I know Ben Howland does not have a good record in Seattle, but it, there's no excuses for that. I know I know Washington's a good team, and I get that. They're I think they're leading the conference right now, record-wise. But I'm still, still very disgusted. Still very disgusted that uh, this team, this team just found ways to collapse, and their chemistry, it's getting better, but they're still not to that point where they were supposed to be before the year started. Uh, they're still an NIT team at the best. Uh, you know, today they beat Washington State, and I'm happy and whatnot that their, their season's not dead yet, but this team's got to win out, pretty much, if they want any shot of making the tournament with an at-large bid. Other than that, it's the Pac-12 tournament. Uh, I don't know if this team's going to do it. If they make the NIT, it's already an insult to itself for a, a UCLA program. Uh, ben Howland, obviously I'm not going to ask him to be fired because that, that would hurt the program more, but the guy's got to get this team together and rally. Cause this team's been struggling with guard play. The guards have been mediocre as hell. Uh, it, it hasn't been very thrilling, to say the least. Uh, painful to watch. It's just a painful team to watch. Uh, they, they beat Washington State mainly because Washington State's not that good. It's just an honest fact. They're they're below medio, mediocrity, and uh, we've had their number in Pullman for some time. But Wazoo, they were kind of chipping back at the lead, and luckily we made just enough free throws to win. But this team sucks at the free throw line. They're inconsistent. Uh, Josh Smith is like the only positive to this team at times, but there were also times he can lack, lack work ethic in other weeks. Still a little overweight sometimes, I feel. Uh, Tyler Lamb, uh, the guy I've been hating a while, he's been very down to me, very very inconsistent, and I'm not liking what I've seen from him. But the team won, and I know I should be happy with that. It's just that this team should be so much better than what they are, and uh, still a disappointing season. I don't know what to think. There's a long way to go, and we'll see what they do, but right now I don't like the odds. So it's happy they won, but... That UW game is still just a bitter taste in my mouth. We'll see you guys later.